The population of Lagos is around about 18 million people and continues to grow at the rate of about 6% per annum. The geographical spread is quite huge. We have 13.2 to 13.4 million motorized trips every day that we have to cater for. The structure of our network can only cater for about 40% adequately. We can understand the pressure that we are under to accommodate the other 60% that the infrastructure is not well designed for. We've observed lots of commuters experiencing very, very difficult and challenging transportation options. As a result of transport and traffic congestion, Lagos State and the federal government and the World Bank came together and said they should find a solution to this problem. And that involved to Lamata. Lamata is taking a huge step in trying to modernize a system that had been abandoned for the last two or three decades. And we're making some bold steps, bringing in BLT, creating a real network. We have various experts that we have to bring together. Engineers, geographers, transport planners, and we all speak different languages. As we grew, with staff getting larger, it was very important to start finding a systematic way of sharing what we had learned in the past and developing institutional memory especially when we had staff leaving the organization and we get new staff in. A whole lot of story was lost. People knew what they wanted to do, but unfortunately it wasn't on paper. So the challenges we had basically was we had no systematic way of sharing knowledge both internally and externally. The World Bank came in to help us to develop some systematic processes to actually capture and keep knowledge. One key thing that came up is to standardize the basic information that everybody needs to know. Anybody that comes in, they know that, okay, documentation is part of what we do. I'm going to the field, whatever I encounter needs to be documented so that if someone else comes and then encounter that same problem, they know what to do. The knowledge sharing process has improved interdepartmental collaboration because now we've seen the value of working together. We have a new system that allows you to create your team with representatives from other departments so that they can add some value and it's improved collaboration. People are more involved in the work together, so it's not seen as one person's project, it's seen as Lamata's project. It's now become easy for someone who hasn't worked on a particular project to come in and blend in because there is a lot of material that the person can read and then pick up. People are beginning to see that cross-functional teams is become inevitable and having to share knowledge obtained from different interventions is very important. Knowledge sharing within the organization has had positive impact on cost savings, fast delivery of projects, innovations, People have been able to come up with ideas that is even beyond my own imagination. I'm excited about knowledge sharing because people in the organization feel that they gain it from each other. It's not HR driven, it's more an organizational initiative that all of us can contribute to. Before the involvement of World Bank, Knowledge sharing has been a very small part of what we have been doing. Now the scale has been increased so much that it has become a cultural thing. We have turned ourselves to a fountain of knowledge in the transport sector. If you want to do transportation within Africa, then Lamata is the first organization to talk to.